There's a somebody I'm longing to see. I hope that he turns out to be someone who watch over me. According to my father, I used to sing in my sleep. I'm a little lamb that's lost. It's a non-auditioned choir, which is the main thing. It started off as five people at First United Church or something, and they really felt that everybody should have the opportunity to be moved by gospel music and so they decided to take it out into the community and from there it just grew and grew and grew and grew. It's not all um, religious music, it's, but it all has a message. Outreach and community and support that's generally the message that the choir is trying to put out there is just, you know, help each other, love each other, be accepting of each other. I mean, we've got all kinds in this choir. My son's father is a musician. He said, I think you'd love the choir, you know. you, you got to come and see it sometime. You know, it's right up your alley. I think you'd really enjoy it. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, okay, whatever, you know. Bleh. Um, and finally they were having their year-end concert and he basically bought two tickets for uh, me and Felix, that's our son, and uh, we went to this concert. He had such a good time, it was like, oh, okay, that's it, I am joining this choir. It's not so much about how we sound, it's about how we make people feel. And as long as you come in just leave your heart on the stage. That's what people respond to. And we've all seen choirs that sound wonderful, but you're not moved by them. And it's a regular occurrence that people come to one of our performances and just kind of go, like, I don't know what happened in there, but like, I felt something. I felt you guys. This is my therapy. <laughs> And I think it's therapy for a lot of other people. There are actually some very damaged souls in this choir. Almost everybody in here will tell you that this is like their second family. It's what keeps me sane. I have to be a step from dead before I won't show up here. And it, for a lot of people, that's what it is. Um, you can just have had the really most horrible day and you're tired and you're depressed or whatever, you're angry at your boss or whatever's going on, you had a fight with your partner, whatever. But just get here and start singing and it all goes away. You can't be in a bad mood when you're singing. It's just not possible. It really isn't. <laughs>